Hi guys, how you doing? How long have you been sitting there? <laughs> this is awkward. Maybe, like, I don't want to, I'm not your dad, but have you been outside today? Maybe just go for a walk around? Five minutes? We'll wait. Get some fresh air. We'll just be playing whatever this thing is. <laughs> <laughs> well, now that you've gone and, and had your walk and you're back, uh, we're here with, uh, on behalf of Geek Mountain, as Geek Mountain, we are Geek Mountain, uh, bringing you a Let's Play of Minecraft. I get it, there's a lot of Minecraft Let's Plays, but we we want to play Minecraft. We're special, because I've never seen this stupid game before. <laughs> He's got I don't even know if it's stupid or not. Let's create a world and, yeah. and jump in. I feel like a god. Alright, so welcome to the Geek Mountain Minecraft server. Why does this game look so bad? <laughs> Part of its charm, Michael. Uh, we are playing survival mode. We are playing on easy. I fully expect Michael to die a bunch of times anyway. Where are? Where is everybody? Good question. All right, I found Michael. All right, so where are you, Rick? Have you found? Oh, there you are, down there. We made a hole. We yeah, had Michael's like a hole. He's doing really well. I'm punching trees with flowers. How have I not played this game? This game's amazing. <laughs> Uh, so, uh, oh. what you want to do first off, Michael, is just get some wood. So if you find a tree, just punch punch the wood. So which which one of you is which? I'm I'm the tennis guy. You're the tennis pro. <laughs> yeah. Am I Nova? Currently? What's what's a tree yeah. look like? Is this right. thing in oh. front of me a tree? So that's that's leaves. Yes. So if you see the wood in the middle of it. Yeah. That's the tree part. The trunk, if you will. What's wrong with my fist? Uh, you, you're currently holding a lump of dirt, I believe, uh, as opposed to a fist. Now I've got wood. Now what? If you press the X button, it brings yes. up all of the, the menu of things that you can make. Um, so with the wood, you can turn the wood into wood planks. So you just cycle through to find what wood you've got, and you can turn into wood planks. Yep. This? Oak planks. Yep. And so you just yep, press the uh, A button to make Create. the planks. Yep. Yep. And then... You can also create, with the wooden planks, you can now turn those into sticks, mm -hmm. or you can create a crafting table uh, so that you can make more items. Ah. So I'll make a... I'll, have you got a crafting table? I just made a crafting table. Excellent. Yeah. Alright, crafting table. Let's, let's, let's put down a crafting table somewhere. Where are we going to build our home? Should we, should we build it in this massive hole near this water? Near this water? Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Should we just dig into this sort of dirt area a bit here? Yeah, clear a bit of a space. Hi, fellas. Oh, you're in a tux. That's very fancy. Look what I made, a stick. Ah, god damn it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey. So we've got stone there, so that might be a nice... Luke Wilson from the movie Royal Tannenbombs. I made a stick. <laughs> Don't make me punch you. Go away. All right. And we have James I'm going to put our crafting table here. Sure. So once we, if, if you use the crafting table instead of just crafting in general, it opens up a bunch of options of stuff that you can actually make properly. So, one of my favorite celebrities in the world loves this game, Dan Harmon, creator of Community. So there must be something in it. Sure. Because that guy's a genius. Well, I think that the beauty of a game like Minecraft is that there's no rules. You can do whatever you want. So you oh, can, can I? Awesome. You can... <laughs> so tools are great for, like, so the pickaxe is great for breaking stone. Shovel's great for shoveling dirt. The axe is great for taking down wood for trees. Uh, the hoe you don't really need at this point. That's for, like, um, laying down wheat and stuff. Sure. Uh, and then you've got a sword so you can defend yourself. Uh, at the moment, because you've only got wood, you can make wood versions of everything. Mm -hmm. But as you go on, you can get stone um, from all of the stone you can see in front of Rick there. Um, so you can make stone uh, tools, or then eventually you can find iron and you can make iron tools, mm. uh, and so on and so forth. And I'm planting a tree in an inappropriate place. <laughs> and you can also do that. Also, because this is survival mode, the little hearts are health, and the little... I think they're supposed to be like drumsticks, but they look kind of like daggled dogs. <laughs> um, that's, that's or corn dogs for our international viewers. Yeah. <laughs> that's our. Uh, that's how hungry you are, or how full you are. I suppose it actually represents. I found a cavern, and uh, the crazy thing about Minecraft is that night monsters come out. So we're probably going to want to build some sort of shelter yes. sooner rather than later. That is that is very true. Uh, another thing we might also try and do is find some sheep. 
so that we can make wool. Or collect wool. And Fascinating. Make, it, make a bed. I, I can tell you're really enjoying this, Michael. I kind of am. I know <laughs> I'm acting like I'm not. This is so dumb, but I can understand the appeal. Yeah. The funny thing is it's more Lego than Lego games. Yes. Like, yeah. The Lego games are great, but they're not anything like when you actually play with Lego as a kid. This is what you would expect if someone told you that there was a Lego game. Now, Telltale's making a... <laughs> Yes. Game. A yes, story-based game about this. Yes. I'm not How sure. is that going to work? I, I don't It'll know. It'll be the first time that they're actually just making up the story themselves. Because there obviously isn't one. I have not seen the sky in a long, long time. <laughs> where, where are you, Michael? Are you digging just... down? <laughs> no, I'm digging up. See? Look how far up I've come. Where are... <laughs> what have you done? Oh, this is chaos. The tool you have using has become damaged. That's good news, right? <laughs> so you've used the tool now so much that it can actually wear through. So you need to, like, build multiple tools. Because just like real life, things get used up. But I can't get back to the crafting table. Because you've dug yourself down into your hole? Yeah. Yeah. That, that world <gasps> I see the sky! It's beautiful! <laughs> it exists. Guys, I'm almost out. <laughs> We're proud I of think. Do we want a doorstep under the door? Or do we... Like... Oh, no. This is just put a door in. Just regular door. This is basics right now. All right. We'll, we'll get fancier as we go along. Fancy? I'm just happy to find a way out. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Okay, I think I might have went the long way out. Where did you start your holes? I don't know. <laughs> but I have 16 pieces of rocks. Okay, right, we got a really, really dark room. You're making torches? Uh, so I'm making a furnace so I can make some charcoal. Nice. This is a depressing house. <laughs> Well, it's, it's not a great start, but it'll keep us safe. Hey, a torch. I have 16 stone. That's also my weight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yep, that's, Sorry. That's I can see why that. people would like a game like this. It's it's quite relaxing. I, I, I find I play this when I need to chill out. Like if I've been playing a lot of Arkham Knight... Uh, and I'm sort of, you know, hitting a difficult area or something, I would turn to a game like this to sort of just relax. Because it's kind of mindless. You can just have fun and break stuff. How do I use my 16 stone, guys? <laughs> you, can, you can place it. Would you like to help me replace this roof? Sure. Alright, I'll do the punch and you do the placing. How do I place? With the other trigger to punch it. So yeah, but at... I've done punching all my life. <laughs> I don't know if I can anti-punch. I'm not. I'm not replacing anything. Oh, I did. I replaced something. I will now replace Rick. No! No! <laughs> no! It's happening again. I'm gonna shut myself off in the danger room. How do you open doors? <laughs> There you go, you just open it like that. No, I'm outside. Fine. <laughs> Are you locking him out? No. He needs the safety of this house. No, I don't. I'm fine on my own. <laughs> I made a big hole. I can go to the big hole. Ah! You guys having fun? <laughs> yep. <laughs> He's bricking us in. Oh no, we'll never get out. Ha 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 ha. It's alright, I can build my own house. There you go. The little house of yours is really driving property prices down, Michael. I'm <laughs> going to have to send a letter to the council. <laughs> One of the things about this game is that it can be quite so relaxing that I just stop thinking about anything else and I can just sit silently and just break rocks for an hour. Which makes for a really good let's play. Yeah, really entertaining. Because we're doing a lot of fun stuff. Just silence. Yeah. I hear you knocking. <laughs> But you can't come in. I want to break down the door with the axe and do my here's Johnny impression. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I just say I just saw how I look. I'm quite fancy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the scariest fancy man you've ever seen. 
I've got a, I've got a door ready for you as soon as you make another door hole. <laughs> Teamwork. Well, maybe I'd knock this one out down here. Are you just punching? Yes. What else can I do? If, so if you build tools, you, the tools will actually make it faster. So that you'll be oh, able now to you tell me. If you, <laughs> I told you that before. If you got a pickaxe, it'll break the rocks faster. And if you've got an axe, it'll okay. break the wood faster. And if you've got a shovel, it'll break the dirt faster. Yeah, so now you'll be able to create uh, stone tools so that they'll be nice and strong so that you can you can do stuff with them. I do like the little uh, fort that you created at the front with uh, cobblestone and dirt. I'm a caveman when it comes to this game. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Here I go! I, I planted some wheat seeds. We're gonna need more. <laughs> it's good. a single tile. <laughs> Where's the water going? Maybe somebody let it away down this little path. <laughs> Maybe someone didn't know what he was doing. <laughs> Excellent. Right. I'm bringing back dinner for us. That's good. Good plan. Hey, one of the trees that I planted has grown. You boys are all scavenging and finding food and planting trees. I'm just making holes. I think that's it's part of the learning process. You gotta learn how to make a hole before you can learn how to make a hole in a cow. <laughs> Basically, it's the exact same game mechanic. <laughs> so a lot of people have spent a lot of money on this game, right? Uh, quite a lot of uh, people have purchased it. I, I'm not sure exactly where the sales. Uh, at Microsoft exactly. purchased it, yes. Well, yes, yeah, but uh, Microsoft turned around and purchased it, so they must be doing something, right? But, um, yeah, it's quite a popular game. And the, the thing with it is that each of the different versions uh, is slightly different. So the version that is on PC is slightly different from the version that's on iPad. Um, the Xbox and slightly different to the version that's on the iPad. Um, so the way that you do things is, is, is sometimes different depending on which one has older versions and which one has what updates and all that kind of stuff as well. So uh, some people actually, like for example, I have a copy of it on my iPad that I can play when I'm on the go, just for a bit of fun. And then I also have my copy on the Xbox One. And when I upgrade to Windows 10, uh, I will be getting the Windows 10 version as well. Hmm. Hey, I got roses. Maybe I'm collecting them and maybe I'm just hitting them with my axe. I'm not sure. <laughs> Is that the same yes. as collecting? So you can actually turn those uh, red flowers into red dye so that you can uh, color things. Ah. Yeah, so if you've got uh, sheep, you can harvest their wool. I can color the sheep? You can actually you color shake. the sheep. <laughs> So you can breed uh, breed purple sheep yeah. if you want. One of the funniest things about it is instead of taking the wool and then dyeing it afterwards, it's actually more efficient to just dye the sheep and then breed them with other dyed sheep so that they actually just make more sheep that already have that wool as their natural colour for some reason. Now, is it a situation where if you breed a red sheep with a blue sheep, you'll get purple sheep? Or um, is I, it not that I, I haven't actually gotten that far into the, the sheep breeding aspect yeah. of Minecraft. I should, I should do some more sheep. I think I'm, I think I'm going to be a, a sheep breeder. That's going to be my new thing. Ah, that's a different word for it that I'd used to go here. <laughs> <laughs> right, so this is Minecraft. Yeah. Sure is. Are you enjoying it? I am. Yeah, that's good. I have no idea what I'm doing. and I, I, well, I think that's exactly where you start. You just, you're in a world, you don't know what to do. You can create some tools and then sort of go from there. Where are you guys? I'm at front of our house. So I've traveled, traveled quite far away in search of food, uh, but I have found lots of grass. So I'm going to wait to Yeah, that'd be good. I found something. <laughs> <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Come up out of the water, probably. Like stop. Jaws, yeah. <laughs> I want to ask you a question. There you go. So now you can grab that. So that was have... much too easy. 
You'll have some leather, and you'll have... Well, have you, you take an axe to a cow's head, I think he's going to keel over pretty quickly. Um, so now you'll have uh, some uh, steak, so uncooked steak, which you can eat if you want. Um, you can eat it raw, and it will give you a little bit of health, but if you cook it, it will actually give you even more health. Is there a map or anything? Because I have no idea where we live. <laughs> Good if we can get some iron, so I can make a bucket and then we can start pairing our furnace with lava. I found coca beans. Let's have coca pops, everyone. Excellent. All right. Well, you you start work on coca pops. Oh, I found a sheep. I found a sheep. All right. I have one wool, as we don't have iron to make clippers. Uh, so you just kill the sheep for the wool. Kill a sheep. I'm gonna jump in this water. Oh god. Here's the sheep. I nearly missed the edge of the. Kill wall. the sheep. I don't know. Hey, sheep. So, that was my pet! Oh. <laughs> hey, man. How you doing? Are you hitting me with an axe? That was, was my pet! Perhaps. Um, where, where did we start? How do we get back to there? Where I'm, are you guys? I'm next to him, but now he's gone. We're together. Oh, we were together. Follow me, friend. Ooh. I think. Um, actually, where is my map? Let's have a look at the map and find out where we are. I'm lost. <laughs> I jumped off the top of a tree into this water, so I'm actually going to have to mine my way back. Oh, I'm starving. Alright, I need to eat something. So I'm going to have to eat this raw beef. How do I eat? I need to eat too. Do you have any food? I killed some meat. Yeah, so you've got some meat somewhere. Where is it? Alright, so, now, because you've got so many items, yeah. not everything is in your bottom menu. So if you press the Y button... Inventory. Bring up your inventory. So you'll have one piece of meat there next to the two leather. So you can go right. up and select that. And I press... Oh. Take. And I put it in my mouth. Is that right? <laughs> uh, so... Once, once you've got it, and you pull it up as an item down the bottom. Yep. Oh, so put it so down here in the bottom? There. Yep. Perfect. Instead of... Dirt. Yep. I threw away my dirt. Ah, oh, so if you just hit it on top of it, yeah. it'll replace it. Oh, oh you collected my precious dirt! <laughs> Now, it's actually getting dark, so we'll probably need to get back to, to Rick quite quickly before it gets uh, to night time. I'm gonna die, you guys. <laughs> Why are you gonna die? Because I'm tunneling my way towards sunlight. Well, sunlight is fading fast. Yes, it is. And I'm at low health from that incident with the raging torrent. Yeah, that will do it. I'm just not eating. Yes. And, yeah, and I'm getting hungry, so... I heard a sheep. All I got is cocoa beans. Useless cocoa beans. Oh, crap. Eat them. Well, well I'm lost. I found a sheep. I found some... Let's go time. ...health bar. I will follow the guy who's attached. Can I guess that I'm heading in the right direction? Well, I'm following you, so... Ah, oh, my ankle. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Hi. I have gotten horribly lost. Because I'm heading towards you. How do I, how am I supposed to find our home now? We're doomed. We should we'll have, have to build, build a new one. Beds. It's so dark, you guys. Yeah, it's a bit gloomy. All right. I can see snow. All right, I can Found see Adam. Found a cow. Go kill this cow make a survival shelter for the night. I thought they smelled better on the outside. <laughs> <laughs> Bad on the outside. Oh, I like chicken. Nobody calls me chicken. Oh god, spider. I do not have the health for this. Where it's is... a spider, Rick. Where is my... Uh oh. Well, Fuck, I'm dead. Is oh, it... well, the benefit is that we... Oh, Creeper. Run. My health bar is dancing. Is that good or bad? 
so that's so I'm at full health, but I lost all of my shit, and I have no idea where you guys are. Are you at so, the house? Where are no. you? Oh, you're not near the house. No, because we didn't make a bed, so we've got no like, save point to go back to when we. Well, I guess now, the gloomiest part of the game ever. Is a good time to end this episode? Yeah. We so, can start back again, refreshed, <laughs> new, knowing that beds are important. I don't even have a map anymore. <laughs> so. Oh, I died. I, <laughs> well, it looks like I've won then. Uh, being the only one. Oh, that's a challenge. Just, Lost and alone in the wilderness, yeah. we will leave you. But I think that's as good a place as any to, to call it for this particular let's play. So, Michael's learnt a few things about how to create tools and we've, uh, dig dirt. We've learnt that Geek Mountain is in fact entirely inhospitable yeah. and does not sustain human life. We, we haven't really achieved much yet. But hopefully next time we get together for another Minecraft Let's Play, we can achieve a little bit more. Even that chicken's a better swimmer than Michael. Yeah, he's doing much better. <laughs> Look at him go. He's the reason I drowned. I was hungry. <laughs> I'm just going to curse the moon. Why? I'm going to eat my raw beef. So we'll see you next time on Geek Mountain. Yeah, so of course, uh, like us on Facebook. Check us out on uh, Instagram. Follow ah. us on Twitter. Uh, join the Facebook group. Uh, join the Facebook revolution. Yeah, uh, Geek Mountain Base Camp. And you can come and join the... The community there have a bit of a chat with us. Let us know what you think of our ability to play Minecraft. Maybe give us a few tips and pointers because we're all clearly really, really terrible at it. Yeah, there's six year olds better than me in this yeah, game. That's hey, that looks like you found that Hey Rick found the house. Homeward bound, what that a way to a, end. What a what a way to end the story. I'm never leaving again. <laughs> we'll catch you next time. Thanks for joining us. I've been Adam. I'm Rick. I think the house is at the bottom of this ocean. <laughs>